something. Right. Okay. As long as they're able to move in and out, <clears throat> and they will, and like I said, they can actually focus quite, you know, quite separately okay. or differently, um, just by their shape. So I wouldn't panic. I mean, right now I'm not seeing any signs of swelling. Looking at this guy right here, and okay. we've seen swelling before. Okay. Yeah. Right now we're just seeing a lot of wrinkles around the edge. Yes. And that could actually be scar tissue from the last one. Well, that I kind of took that into consideration too. Maybe it had gotten so large that it just stretched it, and now he's just got all this extra skin. <laughs> kind of like me after my babies. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'll put this on the video. Oh God! <laughs> I didn't realize you were videoing. I thought you were just looking at him. <laughs> well, we still haven't identified you yet, so. <laughs> Hopefully, nobody recognizes my voice. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> or the fluffy lizard. Oh, wow. <laughs> I keep my mouth shut. <laughs> and my wife can't do it either. <laughs> what are you doing, buddy? Yeah. Are you going to move? Just Come watch on. his eye moving around. He's trying to get warm, I guess. All right, here's Fluffy, our fungal gastritis chameleon. Probably one of the most laid back chameleons I have in my practice. This is his favorite spot on mom. I'm leaving that alone. Um, <laughs> yeah, like your laugh, like my laughter, can't tell you anything else. Anyway, he's uh, he's doing great today. I even went as far as doing a cytology um, to, uh, to check for any sign of fungi in the stool. This guy had a serious uh, fungal infection all throughout his system. We were able to get it seen in his mouth, his colon, cloaca, it was everywhere. Um, he even had some swelling in his uh, in his left eye. So anyway, point being is that swelling seems to have gone down. We've made major leaps and bounds with this guy. Um, we, Mom learned about the, the recheck situation, for him and for rechecks that we're gonna have relapsing disease. This guy's seen a lot of Mr. Conazole since the beginning of this year. Anyway, uh, with that in mind, today he is completely negative. He is doing fine. His uh, um, his appetite. <laughs> Funny how you got that tail up like that. That's pretty awesome. Um. <laughs> anyway, his appetite's on the end. I could show him. <laughs> I'm taking that as a dog show. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna stop laughing now. I'm gonna be serious in one day. It's, anyway, <laughs> we're gonna give him a uh, a free and clear for the doctor for a bit. Um, <laughs> he did have some rather stinky stool today, but stinky stool still can be normal for reptiles. It's just as much as as intimate as I am with this guy's poop, it was just different. So, well, um, keep it. I'm, you're still out of the picture, mom. Don't worry, I'll keep you out. <laughs> um, so anyway, so far so good. We're releasing him from treatment today. Uh, if you have any problems with mommy, bring in some stool. We'll check it out if we okay. need to. In the meantime, just love him and torture him with, with the best love you can. <laughs> good night, buddy. Goodbye. Yeah, good night, buddy. <laughs> Signing out.